being able to have uh, all the players together in, in a single training venue is critical because uh, the first time you're, you're working with a particular uh, service or a foreign uh, country, you don't want to you don't want to be the first time to be in combat. So it's important for us to get together uh, in a training environment so we can work through uh, techniques, tactics, procedures uh, that we can use later. Uh, we're working together in a combat zone. Uh, it's very unique because of, of who we're working with. We're working with the Marines, we're working with the Air Force, we're working with different nations. We get a chance to, to, to fly here at Camp Atterbury with multiple different types of aircraft in the air, deconflict the aircraft space, the, the, the airspace, and then, and then basically document all the lessons learned. We're very excited about the opportunity to really, to really just demonstrate our proficiency in knowledge in this, in this platform and this system. It's very expensive to change the software once it gets to an airplane, but it's very easy to change it when engineers are sitting next to each other on a computer. And we've literally saved um, on the order of millions of dollars in software development costs because of some problem that uh, folks sitting next to each other have found in a lab environment in both quests. The, the biggest value is that we are able to not only do live scenarios, but also involve the technology to see how this technology can support the scenarios and vice versa. Guys from John Staff are doing a very, very good job, and that is the, the, the whole point of World Quest. And that's it. I don't think of any uh, arena that you actually can do that the way we do it now. It, this venue is great. It's close enough to the airbases, so we get a lot of time with the airframes overhead and we have the enough facilities here for more radios than I've ever seen in one spot in my life to all plug in and operate. And the, the range facility itself out there with the, the variety of targets makes the JTACs work and uh, it actually tests the system instead of doing it on a billiard table where it would be too easy. Uh, the ideal of, of working in a complex environment instead of a controlled environment, uh, working uh, as partners and collaborators uh, and also doing so in a manner which uh, we are maximizing the value of the taxpayer's dollar, giving them the most value for the cost, uh, is uh, central uh, to our national security in the 21st century. And so uh, this exercise, I think, just, is just bearing that out for us, is that, we, that, our, that a path that we've launched on is, is a correct path, and we intend to continue to follow on it in, in whatever way we can.